additional officers suffered injuries as a result of the altercation in the household. They were all transported to area hospitals. Thankfully, the latest report is the injuries are not life threatening. <clears throat> Mr. So Song was transported to an area hospital for an evaluation. He suffered uh, what Biggie described as minor injuries. He is in custody. The pending charges of four counts for assault and battery with a dangerous weapon. Four counts of assault and battery and a police officer. The investigation is ongoing with additional charges pending. The officers on scene. Used a great level of restraint in the application of force to obtain uh, today and to take him into custody. Um, he will be arraigned sometime later the, today over Lynn District Court. Um, at this time, I'll take a couple brief questions. Our uh, contact with the individual is limited. Uh, <clears throat> that they're just beginning to comprehend what occurred. And, uh, I think we'll know more once we get additional information from us. Yeah, so how difficult is that for you guys? Um, you know, you talk about routine calls or whatever you can call this. You know, you have a call and you're met with someone with a weapon and then things quickly go south. How difficult is that for you and your officers to deal with? I think, uh, <clears throat> I think it's extremely difficult. Uh, the officers in this department, it's um, a mid-sized department, they're very close. Something like this happens, it kind of strikes home. So, personal for you? Uh, <clears throat> yeah. Are these veteran officers? And how long have they been on the service? Uh, these are veteran officers. Uh, some of the officers have uh, two years of service. One of the officers was probably uh, five, six years. The others are uh, in excess of 20 years of service. Excuse me? That's correct. Two more questions, guys. Do you know the extent of the injuries from this stabbing? Um, they had lacerations and stab wounds to the extremities. Um, I'm told that the injuries are non-life threatening. Um, beyond that, I don't have any additional information. Is, is the reckless car that you all have seen? That's correct. The, the vehicle that was towed from the scene was the uh, unreturned uh, rental vehicle. He resides at the residence. Thanks, guys. Have you had any run-ins with him before? I mean, is he known to you? We had limited contact. Two more questions. Did you the call that was still on the vehicle? Um, it was the uh, rental company who initially reported that the uh, vehicle was, wasn't returned. What, did all the officers respond to the same We had uh, multiple officers respond. We had the, uh, the division that was on respond. We had additional resources from Wakefields, Melrose, who responded along with the state police to assist. No, there were there were initially there were three, uh, two officers, and then additionally uh, additional officers arrived. Describe the weapon that he had. You said it was a sharp edge. I don't have an exact description. We believe it to be a knife in some form. Did he right. was talking. Did they were they in the house? Was happened out of the house? The the initial investigation was conducted, was started outside. The officers made entry and the altercation and the assaults took place inside the residence. All right, thank you. Does mental health appear to be an issue? 